All of Las Cruces is proud of the downtown farmer's market. It's one of the best places to go on a Saturday morning. And one of the most popular stops in the market is the Kettle Corn Guy. News 22's Marlene Barasa gets in line for a tasty snack. It starts with the kernels and some sugar, a little bit of stirring, and you have Southwest Kettle Corn. When Brian Peterson and his wife relocated from Seattle, Washington to Las Cruces, they thought something was missing in town. So 17 years ago, they chose a second job, kettle corn. But it wasn't so sweet to start with. It wasn't very popular at the time. And, and I think it took some time for, for some inertia, uh, for, for some people to understand what the product is. It took some time to kind of get cracking. And get cracking they did. It's become a profitable business, but he says it's about more than money. It's about a connection. And it's very personal to us. It's meaningful to us. It's important to us. Um, and, and how they are and how they feel and how their life is going. These, this is what we're all about. Every batch of kettle corn is made the same way, so people know exactly what they're getting. The regular for the regular, that's right. That's right. Randall Curley has been coming back since he moved to Las Cruces five years ago. So, and I know some people have been talking about it. They've been coming here every... Uh, weekend and they see him every weekend they've been here ever since he started and customers have taken kettle corn all over the world Brian has a map to prove it Southwest kettle corn has not only been in Las Cruces they have also been to many other places such as Madrid Manila and Nigeria the only continent missing Antarctica now people have it as part of you know some sort of notoriety they want to be the one to pin something on the map so they'll take it with them or they'll ship it to friends and family Marilyn Thomas wants to take some back home to Michigan but she doesn't think it'll get there yeah probably for the ride home it's not gonna make it home to the kids <laughs> but she can still come back anytime because every Saturday, Brian the Kettle Corn Guy will be here. It's, it's a wonderful way to spend a Saturday. If I wasn't here, I, I'm not sure what I would do with my weekend. And hopefully, you know, my kids will take over for me so that someday I can sleep in on a Saturday. But, um, but for now, this is a good place to be. Popping corn, one kernel at a time. Marlene Barraza, News 22. So I guess we'll have good weather to go get kettle corn this weekend. Yeah, I'm hungry after watching that one. <laughs>